пожалуйста. and welcome to another stalker online walkthrough and during this walkthrough we'll go ahead and learn how to um, complete the quest forest noise which is simple quest at the uh, Libich forest but this guy which is um, Grish Kovets uh, at the fire right here at the Libich forest by the Libich forest location by the K-12 right here and uh, let's go ahead and folks take the quest and we will show you how to real quick go ahead and walk through this quest it's a very simple quest and uh, it's going to be nice information for those people who would like to complete every single quest in this game stalker and lion and uh, so basically what forest all right i will take it and here we go go ahead and read about it and uh, here's the quest and forest forest noise right here as you can see right here it says forest noise and let's go ahead and real quick show you and crossfire actually will go ahead and lead the way yeah, uh, yeah go ahead it, it took me a little while to figure out exactly where to go on this one but once i figured it out it's the easiest quest in the world to, to do in this game it's literally it's very literally just walking to a point and coming right back Yeah, so basically, uh, we are getting there. And the point actually is going to be in the forest uh, by the H14 right here. And we will show you in a second. So basically, uh, keep your mind, uh, I mean eye on the, right here on this map at the um, right top corner as well as I'm going to press M button on my keyboard to bring you the whole global map and show you exactly as you can see today with me playing uh, players from the last clan which is Crossfire X and Mehmed and uh, we are going to do this class walkthrough for you real quick so you are going to get an idea and after this point we'll just go ahead and uh, record another quest so stay tuned folks I have a bunch of stalker online walkthrough already and a bunch of it is coming it's going to be nice tutorials quest walkthrough uh, from the experienced players so stay tuned pretty much you need to run over here I'm not running too quick because I grab with me the MGD and when you hunting you probably want to keep this uh, at the locker at the vault at the storage but because it weighed 15 k's uh, 15 kilos kilo, kilograms but just because when we were hunting a lot I saw a lot of anomalies as well and uh, this time I decided what the heck you know I will get and carry with me the MGD all the time because hunting is very nice and great but the artifacts will cover like half day of hunting in this game so and just because uh, as you can see I'm with the HK416 and I'm looking to get myself a hammer, sledgehammer and uh, there is a place where you can exchange and get yourself a sledgehammer and how to get a sledgehammer I will go ahead and explain to you folks uh, real quick uh, it's then, uh, jackhammer yeah uh, sorry yeah jackhammer and I will explain to you how to get the jackhammer it's going to be in the next video tutorial which will be dedicated how to get the jackhammer so go ahead and um, check my profile if you're watching this over the YouTube as well as I'm going to go ahead and make multiple playlists for Stalker Online and uh, I'm going to uh, basically organize them as a beginner as a quest walkthrough, as a tips, as advanced uh, quest walkthrough and etc as you can see um, we're just running and uh, I'm right now close to the M14 and the quest we, we're going to complete quest by the H14 so we come into that area so 
So while I'm running, let me real quick show you my um, equipment. So right here you can see I'm with the HK416. I have the Desert Eagle. And let me go ahead and right click on them and show you the information of my equipment. And Desert Eagle right here. Sequoia backpack and then turn chuck pads right here check uh, jacket and tash vest nice and there is a bear actually coming right is a bear crossfire uh yeah It'll okay be here a just a sec the bear basically respawning over here by this area by H14 sometimes so keep that in mind basically H14 right here H13 like I'm going to set the right click on the map and I can set the mark bear it's going to be young bear you can do that as well setting some nice check marks on your map And pretty much, did you kill the bear, Crossfire? Uh, no, he's not showing us. Uh, he's not showing up. Uh, I'm looking for him though. Yeah, so we want to be careful. In the Stalker Online, it's great to play with the uh, with your friend because when you're with your friend, you know it's much easier, and you can connect through the Skype. As you can see, I'm talking to the Crossfire through the Skype. And by the way, this tutorial today was recorded with mouse video capture software that was developed by me uh, to capture uh, your desktop screen, to capture your portion of your desktop screen. You can make like video tutorials, how to use the software, how to use the computer, or you can also record the gameplays of your favorite games with mouse video capture software. So keep that in mind, folks. And I'm using uh, Mouse Video Capture software today basically to capture this uh, gameplay. So pretty much over here by the H14 will be a big base and currently it's a Less Light clan, which is my clan. One of the best clans in Stalker Online in 2013 by the way. And they're holding this base right here. And let me just go ahead and uh, show you on the map right here it's in the middle of H14 O14 H15 O15 right here okay uh, be careful approaching this uh, there's a uh, Verlioka and uh, you have to hit these trees though hold on I'm coming it's either here at O14 or O15 but it's one of the two and it's really quick so Right here, between you. Yep. But you gotta be really careful. There's Verlioka around. And, like right here, there's one. Oh, that's Verlioka. I'm just gonna... Um, it, it's just going to eat my Desert Eagle. Uh, well, I just took one with a 9... Wait, when you're hunting the Verlokas, this is a little tip for you for hunting. You wanna come at them from the hill. It's easier. And Verlokas are very quick. Uh, mutants but when they coming from the bottom to the hill their speed basically decreasing and it's easier for you to aim at them from the hill from the top of the hill once the video is done I've, I've got something pretty cool to tell you all right. Uh, I will let you know. Yeah, but I just don't want to mention any names during the video. Gotcha. So, people, if you wanna, 
get friends here. There's a bunch of great players in here. And sometimes not great players, sometimes can be greedy. You know, it's this game is so amazing because it's like live, but like in virtual world. And there's so much stuff to do, like in, in the live. You can work, you can trade, you can Here it is, business. it's right here. Just walk right over here, where I am, standing. Yep. And you'll get it. People but look see out, that? there's, Ver there's Verlioka. Quest uh, oops. Quest uh, for Vario Locus you're getting 192 points as you can see. Combat and you can see folks right here it's saying the quest right. is updated. Let me show it to you right here. Yeah. Like pretty left much just walk towards this pair of trees right here and you'll complete the quest. Yeah, and on the map, let me show you on the map, it's going to be right here folks. Zoom in. Look out. This. Yep. I don't think so, buddy. Yeah, so check it out. It's going to be right here on the map. 014 and close to that swamp right here. By those trees. See? Two trees right here. And there is two trees right here. So it's going to be right here. See that? Right here. I need to just come here. Just walk through those two trees right here. Just walk through and the quest should be completed. And basically it's going to say the quest is updated. Did it tell you the quest is updated? Yeah. And then after this point you just walk right back to the guy who gave the quest to you and turn it in and it's done. Yeah, let me maybe real quick just run to it and show folks what does it do. So this is what quest is updated and I'm going to just real quick folks for you to run on my time and show you what exactly you're going to get after quest is completed. real quick Okay, so we're coming right here and by M pressing on this icon of this guy you can put your guy in the middle of the map and we come right here by the K12 it's going to be fire and we're going to complete this quest just for you folks and it's actually a great quest to complete because um, Actually, I'm not overwhelmed. I'm, I'm not sure why, but sometimes my character is getting sl like slow. I'm not sure why, but uh, check your weight. Yep, it's it's like it's it's still under 49. It's under not not. No, uh, I mean like what's your total weight that you're carrying right now? Like 49 kilos. And what's your current weight? 
Uh, that you can carry. 49. No, I mean like, uh, how much are you carrying and how much is your total? Like 49 and 49, but they can carry Yeah, but that's why you're, uh, you're slow because you're at your, you're reaching your maximum weight. Yeah, but I can put 20 on top of it. Hold on, one second. So you wanna, guys, talk to Gris, Gris Kovac, right here, as again, by K12, right here. Let me zoom in, right here on that line. By the fire, it's, you're not going to miss him. And go click F button him. I saw the forest, and here we go. It's normal forest, no magic, because this guy thinking it's a magic in the forest. And just basically complete it. Here's what you're getting, right here. Basically, it's a great quest to complete, because you're getting a lot check it out I'm just going to scroll out for you put it in pause and have a look and for you to decide I bet there is on YouTube going to be a bunch of folks that try to complete every single quest so this is what I'm dedicated for you folks 1000 rubles not so many but units of the support survival this is what you're looking for to level up everything is counting actually and as again this was a quest forest noise and also this guy going to give you the most so this is important item too. Let me show it to you. Right here. It costs 15 rubles, but this moth, um, moth will be passed or uh, part of the exchange. So so keep this in mind. You will click info right here. It doesn't weigh too much, like 50 grams, but this more moth will be part of the exchange. Like you can exchange it for a nice stuff and I will go ahead and cover it for you later on and when I will record this video I will also put the video uh, to that link I mean link to that video in the video description below thank you so much for watching my name is Alex Morose and uh, please thumbs up for more video to come through and subscribe for more and I will see you guys till the next video tutorials originally from Alex Morose bye bye now